If alcohol is forbidden on earth, why is it halal in heaven? Alcohol is a substance that clouds the conscience. And when conscience is overwhelmed, people do not have beneficial knowledge. Rasul Karim Salalahu Alayhi Wasallam to his beloved companion, he bequeathed that, that is, never drink any kind of alcohol. Because this is the root of all obscenities, the question is what the heavenly wine will be like, it is stated that four springs will flow in paradise by the command of Allah. One of milk, the second of honey, the third of wine and the fourth of water. One will not combine with the other, in another hadith, the wine of paradise will have the fragrance of camphor. It will not be sour and drunk like the wine of the world. There is no room for indolence, no opportunity for vomiting. There will be no foul odor, this will be heavenly wine, alhamdulillah, that is, if people drink worldly wine, they become unconscious and drunk, but if they drink heavenly wine, no one will become unconscious and will not get drunk. Jannati Shabab will be like a special type of sherbet. So it is not acceptable to compare it with worldly wine, first, Ibn Rajab al-Hambali, may Allah have mercy on him, said, whoever fasts, abstains, from his desires in this world will break his fast with them after death. Whoever hastens to take what was forbidden to him before death will be punished in the hereafter by being forbidden from it and not being given it. The proof of this is the saying of Allah, they will be told, you took your good things in the life of this world and enjoyed it. Surah al akaf verse 20, The Holy Prophet, peace and blessings of Allah be upon him, said, He who drinks wine in this world will not drink it in the hereafter. A person who wears silk in this world will not wear it in the hereafter. Secondly, Allah says, In paradise you will be given whatever you desire and you will get whatever you desire there. Prostration, 31